have some deer where I'm staying, look. Here in Germany. Hello, you see me? <laughs> oh, you heard that, eh? Look at that. Okay, go on, I'll leave you alone. Do your morning washing up, rise and shine, boys. <sighs> Let you be. Look, now they're both alerted. They're both very much alerted. There they go. <laughs> there you go. Off you go. Oh, again, another place. This is where I'm working now. This is where I'm sleeping. My backpack. All the gear, all the stuff. And uh, so I'm in uh, in the Black Forest in Germany. That's where the uh, the deer were before. Look, it's a lot. It's pretty cold. Look, it's a lot of ice. It's pretty thick, eh? And uh, yeah. Well, this is what it looks like when I look outside. Pretty nice. This is the Black Forest. Beautiful. So, here's my food in the fridge. Cordon Bleu from France. Achille Buff, <laughs> coleslaw. I like that. I, I really like coleslaw. Eh? So the guy I'm staying here at, he's uh, well, he's a fan of my videos. So I'll make him another one. I'm making here the one about the uh, the Alien Covenant and how the Swiss are behind it. You know, Giga. So here's some Swiss water. They need to have the Swiss cross on it, otherwise, you know, they don't drink it, you know. They think they're being poisoned or absolutely paranoid, you know. And here, why the V like this? Because it's a Templar V. And here's sort of a monk, probably a Templar monk with a V on it, carrying a V. And... Here too, even on a on a bag of uh, tortilla chips, crisps. There's the temp the uh, the Swiss cross. Here I got some garments. You know, I don't think it's Swiss, but uh, it says G star. You know why? 
It's always the G in the middle of the square and compass. And this was also in the garment. Why does it say raw? Well, I read war, you know, and it has this G sort of. Here too. This is Swiss again. A G. Why do I do it? In a circle for the compass. Right? All the, the, these creeps, you know, they're all like all these secret symbols all over, you know, the, the V and the G. You know, they're transmitting information, you know, secretly, like a conspiracy. It is a conspiracy. And also the bacon here, <laughs> you know, it must have a, uh, a Swiss flag on it, you know. And it says, Bratspeck, bacon. You know. and even here on the price, you know, the thing you stick on here, there's a Swiss flag. Swiss pigs, eh? Talking about Swiss pigs. There you go. I wonder which Swiss pigs they mean. Yeah. For the Swiss pigs and the bacon, it needs a Swiss flag. You know, otherwise, it cannot be digested, sort of. It's amazing. And also the Swiss eggs. You know, it's on, on, it, it needs a Swiss flag. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. So anybody recognize it's a uh, it's a uh, Swiss chicken? Probably not a Swiss flag on its ass somewhere or something, you know. I'm almost tempted, you know, to open it up and look at the eggs if the if the chicken makes a Swiss flag on it, you know, automatically, you know. Probably they call it Eidgenössische Gesetze, you know, some some law, some Swiss law that the chicken needs to put a, a Swiss flag on it. You know, you know it's like Old Mac Swissy had a farm. Yeah, yeah, ho. Old Mac Swissy had a farm. Oh, I can make another clip of the out of that. Eh? The Old Mac Swissy had a farm. And now something we used to call in the army splitting up the coffee, you know, because we didn't always have the time to uh, to boil the water and carry all the water, you know, and we needed to have a little punch of the coffee, you know. So, so here's like uh, coffee, instant coffee. Here's some cream and there's sugar and here's a cup. So... You know, well, cream, we usually not always had it, but uh, just sugar and coffee. So I put some cream in here. I mean, we were thinking, like, well, what, what is the thing we want, you know, in a coffee, you know? Uh, well, it's definitely not the... Uh, <clears throat> the load of hot water in it. You know, what, what what do you like in a coffee? Well, that's the coffee, the sugar, and the cream. You know. So, we used to split up the coffee. Here's some coffee in here. You know. And it was quite light, you know. It didn't take much time. We had it all prepared. And now, you know, just mix it all, you know. And you take a little half a spoonful or just a little bit you know it's like drinking a coffee you know just don't need all the hot water you know and then we got quite thirsty afterwards we drank the water like afterwards it's, you know saving a lot of time and actually the thing in the coffee the thing in the coffee that you know that makes coffee coffee and make you wake up like is that every plant has a uh, has chemicals you know to uh, um, to combat the um, the uh, the insects, you know, to keep the insects away. And if you take and some uh, of the chemicals like coffee, you know, it uh, when we take it in, 
our whole body is like reacting like there's an invader, like an insect, you know, it must be really alerted and being woken up, wake up, you know, and this is how coffee works, you know, it's just a chemical, you know, to, uh, to take away the, uh, to keep away the insects and well sometimes the adversary the other the other military is being you know we also call them insects sometimes you know <laughs> you know what i mean but anyway probably coffee is not very good uh not good for the muscles it stays 24 hours gives a um it, it, it keeps your muscles quite stiff you know and, and uh, it's not really good so best thing is not to drink it at all probably but, you know, sometimes it was okay. You know. So this is what we call in the army splitting up the coffee. You know. And usually we just had the coffee only and, and sometimes the sugar. And real rarely the cream. Mostly in a combat situation we didn't have the cream, you know, too much weight. And, uh, but on an exercise we had the cream with it. Yeah. I see now it's almost ready. It just take a little bit like this, you know. And oh, it's like drinking a coffee. And you know, you take the water afterwards, you know, if you're if you're getting thirsty, if you find any water, even if you don't want to find any water, you know, at least you had your coffee like, you know, like in the morning or splitting the coffee. And, uh, I mean, this is what you like about the coffee, isn't it? Loads of sugar, the cream, and the coffee. You know, forget about the water, you know. What's, what, what's about a cup of hot water only, you know? This is not what you want, eh? So you just split it up and take what you want, eh? That's what we did. Easy peasy, you know. And usually, you know, we just, you know, we got all abbreviations in the army, you know, we, we just said, hey mate, who's going to do as a split, you know. And these are the kind of weird things you get if you put a, a lot of guys together, if you put a lot of weird old lads together, you know, you get these sort of weird things, you know. But it was quite practical, you know, you should, you should try it out. So, you all go try and... Do a split, eh? You know, the good thing of taking your coffee like that is, um, you know, the yin and the yang. A lot of water is yin, you know, and makes you weak and, you know, blowing up, you know, swollen up. And that makes you tired, you know. You, you know, with drinking coffee, you know, as soon as the, um, the effect of the coffee is gone and the, um, and the, um, and the, and the warmth it's giving you, the warmth of the hot water, and that's gone. You know, you're tired. You said, well, let's switch on the TV, let's lie down, you know, you're tired. You're not moving anymore, you know. And with this, you know, it's very young. You know, it's like there's no water in it. So, you know, you're ready to go, you know. Uh, that's the young, the male energy in it, you know. Uh, the female energy, yin, is like, well, let's stay at home and do the kitchen and, you know, look after the nest and the babies and the food. And that's yin, you know, like drinking a coffee at home and, um, you know, uh, sit down and um, enjoy the show or whatever, you know. So this is a good way of, you know, get, getting the young energy of, uh, because coffee in itself is very young as well. And if you don't, uh, if you do the split, no water, it gets very young with the sugar and the energy. You just get the energy. It's like a, it's like a medicine, you know, it's like a pill. <laughs> you know, it's another way of think outside the box, you know. Right.